Microbes are tiny organisms that can be seen with a microscope. Yeast is a kind of microbe that eats and grows just like you. It makes bread rise. Scientists have discovered that they can use yeast to make a biodegradable plastic, a plastic that won't be bad for the environment. We're entering the fermentation lab, which is where we use microbes like yeast and bacteria to make things that can help the environment. Dr. Gross will show us how yeast will convert this vegetable oil into this powder, which makes this plastic. We're going to talk about how we can use a yeast to convert natural oils to a monomer. What is a monomer? What do we do with a monomer? Well, a monomer is a molecule that is a building block. So this molecule that's a monomer is a bead. We'll string lots of beads together, and when we put all those beads together, we have a long chain, and that's a polymer. Afterwards, we're going to show how we can process that polymer into a plastic, a biodegradable plastic made from nature. That makes it renewable, and it makes it safer for the environment. This is the fermenter. It keeps the conditions just right for the microorganisms so they can grow rapidly. One of the foods that this yeast really likes to eat is oil, natural oil, vegetable oil. And we're going to put it in the fermenter using a syringe. We pierce through. It's been 48 hours and the yeast have been working really hard. So let's pull out some of the yeast and the product, the chemical monomer that we're going to make into a plastic. Look at that. The monomer is coming out from solution. This centrifuge is designed to spin really, really fast. Taking out the tube, what we have at the bottom of the tube is the chemical monomer. Here's our beautiful monomer that we made using the yeast that converted the natural oil to this bio-based monomer that we are going to convert to a polymer and a plastic. You know, kids, this wasn't easy. It took us four or five years of hard work in the lab to make this process work. Here's the monomer that we're going to make the plastic out of. The key thing we need to do is to heat this monomer up to about 200 degrees C. Now this is a special, really hot bath that we're gonna to use to heat this flash. So here we go, we're gonna raise it up. Well, that solid is now melted and it's now a, a liquid. As you notice, it's changed a lot. It gets to be a really thick liquid and when we cool it down, you're gonna see that it turns into a solid. This is a biodegradable plastic, a bio-based plastic that we made from renewable resources instead of petroleum. It's not a powder anymore. This stuff is tough. All right, I'm gonna flip this lever, press these two green buttons. So now we can peel it off. Wow. And look at that, now we have a plastic material. And this is pretty tough. You know, kind of reminds me of the kind of plastic that you use to, to put your food in. We can do so much with this.